So as we come up on the roof, we can see that the raccoon has been attacking every single roof end up here, trying to get in. And if you come over here, this one's open. So the customer has been hearing babies. So a mother and babies are living inside this attic. And we'll get them out. She's, I just saw her in that corner. This is her entry hole here. So we're very close to it. So I'm gonna climb up and head on over there. That's not where you were lying before. Okay, so she's in that far right corner. I actually saw her over on the top of the bathroom over here. So I'm going to head that way to the left to go see if there's babies. So that's where I know she was. She's just hiding in that far corner. I don't hear any babies. But she's hollowed out a lot of the spots over here. <coughs> yeah, I'm not seeing or hearing any babies. Really? No. Did he hear them? That's what he said. He said he heard chittering. Quiet. Let me come in. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to use the grabbers oh, to get them. <coughs> this is about as tight as it gets. So. As you can see, most of the time we're in very tight spaces like this. You have no room to move. But since they're so far, I can use the grabbers and start grabbing them and hope they don't cry. And watch for mum. So there's one. There's quite a few, so go kind of quick just because I'm in such a tight spot. Hey, mum, get out. She's, she's okay. She's okay. Okay. She just came out and looked at us. Okay. It's okay. We got her. Number two. Let me just shine back at her for a sec. Yeah, she's gonna come out with us. Mom, ah, get, get, get. It's okay. I will tell you when there's a problem. That's it. Okay. Quiet. Number three. So, since the mother has been coming out to look at us. I think there's a good chance we can get her on the outside to come get them. <laughs> Number four. Yeah, there's one more. Quiet, 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 quiet. Last little guy. Okay, why do we want to keep him quiet? So the reason we're keeping them quiet is because as soon as the mom hears that cry, she comes looking at us and if she was more aggressive, would come <coughs> charging at us. So, you gotta move quick, especially when you're in a tight space like this. You have no room to really defend yourself. So, that's why we keep them quiet, put them in the bag with each other, which will keep them from crying. Uh, we'll head outside quickly, and hopefully get the mom to come out.
you can't do this job without being okay with tight spaces and squeezing around things. But we'll go down now. Turn around. She's up there. The mother's up there, yeah. Yeah, we saw her. She was yeah. coming near us. We might be able to lure her out. They're in your attic, yeah. Oh, in the other house, yes. Oh, yeah. And one house over, it looks like, too. Both your neighbors, yeah. yeah. Do you want to see a baby? You want to see the babies? No! Yeah. You, you don't get to see baby raccoons every day. Come have a look and get your camera. You might want to take some pictures if you get kids you want to show them. Um, they're about a week, maybe a little older than a week, but yeah. So their eyes are still closed and their ears, they don't open until 21 days. Okay. So. You want to take a picture? <laughs> it's up to you. Oh uh, okay. yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cute. Actually. Yeah, no, they are yeah, cute. Yeah, they are. Little panda bears. Yeah. So we'll bring them up there and try to get the mother out. Right now, she might come out and grab one. If not, then we put over the one-way door I was talking about on. Okay, that was successful. So we'll just leave this stuff here and bring the babies on the roof. Try to get the mom out. We're heading up to the roof. The mother might already be up there. But if not, we'll get one of the babies to cry on the roof and hopefully she comes out. Her entry hole is very close to where they were and where she is now. So hopefully we see her. Grab a baby, place him where she'll see him. Come on, go. So the baby's crying a lot, even though she's with he's with his mom. Take your time, mom. Take your time. So we want to give her room. Don't want to pressure her but she's going down the way that she always goes down. The customer has seen her climb this wall before. And there she goes. So that's perfect. You always want a mother to grab a baby while we're still on site. Just shows that the relocation will be successful. And she came out so fast. That was immediate. As soon as I walked over behind the hole, she was already popping out, so that went well. And now we'll grab a baby box, put the rest of them in there, fix all this mess that she made, put some prevention down, and this will be problem solved. All of the damage that the raccoon did on this roof trying to get in wasn't intentional. They don't mean to be destructive. She was just looking for a place to live. So she had tried every single roof until she 
got in that further roof vent and could have been because she was pregnant. She needed a place to get in quickly, but like I said, they don't mean to do it. If you come over here, you can see that we've closed her, her hole because we did watch her come out and grab a baby. So all the prevention is done. Her entry hole is closed so that when she does come back tonight, she won't be able to get back in. We have the baby box here, which we'll put right by her entry hole. And we'll screw it in. And we were hoping she'd come back one more time while we were here, but because it is daytime, she may not feel comfortable. So the babies will be warm and safe in this box while they wait for her today. It's always so cool seeing these guys, no matter how many times we've seen them. They're so cute, and they get even cuter once their eyes open and they have their own personalities. You put them in the box. So there's four total here, and the mom has one, so there was five. It's cool to see how their mask is already, the coloration is there. And their tails, if we look at their tail, you can see the rings starting. <laughs> okay. It's pretty warm out today, but tonight will be cooler. So just in case she doesn't come till later, we'll be turning the heating pad on. I won't put it on full heat just because it is kind of warm. We'll close the box. And close the door slightly.